Royal baby fever ramps up in London as world awaits arrival of Prince Harry and Meghan's baby. Royal baby fever has ramped up in London as the UK awaits the arrival of Prince Harry and Meghan's baby, with many betting on it being a girl. William Hill spokesman, Rupert Adams says Diana is a red-hot favourite for the name if it's a girl and Arthur is a favourite if it's a boy. Robert Johnson, author of Prince Charles at 70, Our Future King, says the seventh in line to the throne has already gained a lot of attention. Meghan, American, divorcee, biracial, marries Prince, Prince Harry, their child is going to be an incredibly important child in terms of the monarchy but also in terms of America. I have not seen this much interest in anybody not even Kate when she married Prince William. The royal baby is also important to the economy with the merchandise almost ready to go. Victoria Eggs of Victoria Eggs Limited a merchandise designer and business owner says, The only bit of information we are waiting for at the moment is the date of birth, the baby name and whether it's a boy or girl. Pre-orders are in their thousands. The UK and America are particularly interested and Australian and New Zealand as well definitely coming up close behind. Experts believe the new arrival will bring in around $2 billion over two years and a wave of tourists, especially Americans. Tracy Halliwell, Visit London's Director of Tourism says, a royal baby just tops it off and so a lot of people will think actually that's the time to go to London because not only do I want to see all of those royal things but I might get a glimpse of a royal baby or I might get swept up in that fever. We've heard of particularly Americans who have planned their visits to come around this time and hoping they can catch a glimpse of Meghan and the baby. As soon as the baby is born the London I will be lit up in red, white and blue to give the public a chance to celebrate because it could be a few days before the royal baby arrives. The Duke and Duchess are keeping their birthing plans private and say they'll share their exciting news only after they've had a chance to celebrate privately as a new family, a break from recent royal tradition. They are rumors of a home birth in the couple's new home at Frogmore Cottage in Windsor. For now it is just a waiting game.